Library, where JAM stands for Jesus and Me. Hi, I'm Dr. Terry, children's pastor for Faithful Central Bible Church. Happy Thanksgiving! I know Thanksgiving isn't until Thursday, but by the time I see you next, Thanksgiving will be over. Thanksgiving is all about giving thanks, isn't it? We thank God for all the good things he does for us. What are some things that you want to thank God for this year? Well, I'm thankful for you taking the time to watch and learn every single week. In our Bibles, Paul wrote that we should always give thanks. It's in there, in the book of 1 Thessalonians, chapter 5, verse 18. It says, Give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. Give thanks in all circumstances means we should thank God when things are good and when things are bad. Let's practice. Let's pretend that you're all on a sports team and I'm your coach. If our team just won a game, what could we thank God for? Hmm. We could thank him for letting us win. But what if our team lost? Then what could we thank God for? Hmm. We could thank him for letting us play well and have fun together. Okay, okay, here's another example. What if it was a beautiful, sunshiny day outside? What could we thank God for? We could thank him for the nice, warm weather. But what if it was a rainy day? What could we thank God for then? We could thank him for the rain that helps the grass and other plants grow. Okay, here's the last example. What if someone was sick and we prayed that they would get better and then they did get better? What could we thank God for in that situation? We could thank God for healing the sick person and making them healthy again. But what if we prayed and God didn't heal the person? What if the person even got worse and died? What could we thank God for then? Well, we could thank God for the person that they had a great life and that we'll see them again someday in heaven. You see, whether good or bad, there's always something to thank God for. That's why Paul tells us, give thanks and all circumstances. Let's pray and give thanks right now. Dear God, thank you for being such a good God. You are so good. No matter what happens, we can always pray and thank you for something. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Children, thank you so much for joining me today. And don't forget to please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. I'm Dr. Terry, and I'll see you next time.